hello guys good morning welcome back to our channel or should i say good early afternoon don't mind the appearance i look like a sweaty ratchet mass but we're pretty much going through it here in this apartment it is so hot in here it's been unbearable and i don't know how people in this apartment building are surviving because it's like really bad but I also ended up missing our first Monday upload because I did have some health issues. I've been going through my period for over a month, TMI, <laughs> but I ended up in the emergency room because it got pretty scary and I don't really want to go through it because it's kind of gross. That's been going on and dealing with the heat and only having one little fan in this entire apartment is kind of difficult <laughs> we do have two more fans coming in the mail hopefully today or tomorrow and then we'll have one fan in my room one in my son's room and one in the living room i've been co-sleeping with my son in my single bed and it's been kind of rough i don't have my bed rails anymore because i don't sleep with him anymore and i've had to use pillows to blockade him so he wasn't falling off and that takes up half the bed plus him sweating to death through his like thick curly hair all over my pillows isn't helping i know there's people out there that have it worse than we do like i can sit here and say i'm so grateful to live where i live and have a roof over my head and food to eat so there's not much to really complain about but we're just kind of going through it and we'll eventually you know be okay but it's just taking a bit of time to adjust to this new you know life of sweating all day long and not being able to breathe <laughs> it's another hot day i don't really know what's going on today because i'm waiting on an order from walmart for some essential items that i needed to get since i am struggling still with my health it has not gotten any better I just decided, screw it, I'll make the order online, have it delivered to my house, and all I have to do is go down to my lobby and pick it up. It's just a day of cleaning as best as I can and trying to stay as cool as possible. <laughs> so we'll just see you guys in a little bit because I have no clue what's going on and I'm dying and sweating like a pig in this bedroom without central air. So as you guys can see, this is the little fan we have going. It's from Walmart. I know it looks ratchet, but it's because there's lots of dust and dirt inside of it. I need to clean it. And then over here we have Mr. Michael. He's just eating some food. I let him sit until he tells me he's done. I don't rush him. He had some eggs with ketchup, which surprisingly he ate almost all of it. And he had one piece of toast cut up with some butter on it. And then these little tater tot hash browns. I'm really proud of him right now for how much he's eaten because I've been going through a challenge with this boy getting him to eat. He won't even eat his favorites. Like, he loves pasta. He won't eat it. He loves peanut butter jelly. Won't eat it. If anybody has some tips and tricks on how to get a almost two-year-old to eat when they're struggling to eat food please let me know because that's something I'm really struggling with mr. Michael watching his favorite blues clues okay it's on all day long did get my order from Walmart and I actually gave them a bad review and I feel horrible because it said my order was delivered, but I never got a call. I never was told nothing, and I thought it was left in my lobby. So I got my son all dressed and his shoes on, and we go out the door, and it's sitting outside my door. Nobody even knocked, nothing. Like, it's only maybe 10 feet from my couch to the front door. But I decided to give this a try. It's the Nest Cafe Sweet and Creamy Ice Java. Looks like this. It says on the back here you use one tablespoon, which is 15 milliliter, and then you use um, some ice and then some milk and you stir it. And it's supposed to be like an iced coffee. It tastes like chocolate milk to me. That's just literally what it tastes like. And I mean, it's okay, but 
I did screw up. <laughs> I took my son's 3% milk and I poured it in and I was thinking, oh my God, what am I doing? And I had already poured like all of it. So I took a bit of 2% and or 1% I should say. And I mixed it together and I mean, it tastes fine. It just came out looking like chocolate milk really, so. Yes. Yeah, it just tastes like a hint of coffee, chocolate milk kind of. I mean, it's good. I'll still, you know, give this a shot. Also ordered this giant bag here of mixed chips. So in here we have four smart food, white cheddar, four crunchy Cheetos, four barbecue ruffle, four Dorito nacho, and four ketchup. And the reason why I picked this one out of all of them is because my son loves the white cheddar popcorn. And I thought these were not crunchy, but they are. I mean, my son does love Cheetos, but he could still, you know, try it. And I do love ketchup chips. Doritos are okay, not my all-time favorite. And I love barbecue, but not Ruffles, but I can live with it. So this is my view outside of my 10th story apartment. I'm afraid of heights, so this is a big deal. And I kept saying and talking to my mom or my grandmother, I should say, about if I'm facing the pool. And because I've actually been brave enough to come out here, I am facing the pool. What? That's so sick. Wow. But if you look closely, way out there, you can actually see the lake, which is really, really sick. And then this is just the highway that takes you to Niagara Falls. Hello guys, so it's been a few hours. Here we got Mr. Michael. He's just running around in a diaper. Say hello. Hi. It is just so hot in here. We got Mr. Michael roaming around here. We got our fan blasting and I'm still a ratchet mess. I do have an update. I am going over to the old house tomorrow afternoon. I have a ton of stuff still left over there. Well, not a ton. I should say just like bits and pieces that I need to organize through. So I have to organize between um, what's garbage, donations, and what I'm keeping. I also have a driving lesson at 10 o'clock in the morning on Thursday so the plan is to spend the night so that my mom doesn't have to drive 30 minutes um, each way and spend all this extra money on gas and stuff I, I was gonna cook a hello fresh meal but because I am struggling with standing for too long periods of time with my cycle just having like this horrific flow i decided we're just gonna order in some pizza something i know that michael likes and we'll eat i was going to make these meatballs they're cheesy meatballs actually with cheese inside there's spinach in it with some pasta i will do that probably tomorrow which i will actually end up bringing to my mother's house oh no our living room is quite a disaster. All his toys are everywhere. I actually still have not received my dining room table and chairs yet. Ikea, I don't know what was going on with Ikea, but they just cannot get it together with their third party uh, delivery system. Once my mom's out of the house, we can start really getting things organized. I have a lot of pictures and stuff I wanna start putting up. I have little bits and bobs like, um, a key rack that I want to hang up near the front door. Actually, once things are all like put together and settled, I will definitely be doing a apartment tour, which I know some people are really wanting me to do that. And I will, I'll get that done, I promise. Now awaiting on our pizza delivery and gonna eat dinner and watch some TV, just relax and enjoy the rest of the evening. Hello guys, I'm here with baby Michael. He's just having his bottle before bed. I thought we would just pop in and give a little outro and just say good night. I know this vlog was all over the place. There was nothing fun or interesting about it, but just some updates of what's been going on um, since we've been here the first week. And I hope you guys really enjoyed it. 
I'm just going to sit and watch some TV. Michael's going to head to bed. And then tomorrow, we'll be heading back to the old house to finish up some last minute things, laundry, all that kind of good stuff. And we will see you guys very soon. Bye! Say bye, Michael!